Audrey Christie here, and this is super real life because my cat is pro this is her room, but I'm here in the laundry room and I want to talk to you and show you our Keep Calm kit. Storm season has gone off with a bang in Texas, and um, as it does every year, but we have something to help us because the kids are old enough now that they kind of realize what's going on, um, and so we want to make sure that when we send them to our laundry room for... Um, Sorry, the cat keeps bumping. <laughs> for storm shelter, um, because oftentimes their dad and I go outside and watch <laughs> for the storm because we're good, good southern people and that's what we do. So I'm in my laundry room in the terrible lighting to show you our Keep Calm kit. So I'll show you a little bit about what's in there. We have, oh, we have, um, stuffies, right? And the stuffies are two small stuffed animals that they like, but they don't love so much that they can't live in the Keep Calm kit all the time. Um, we have a flashlight, and then we have little pin lights for the girls to use. Sorry about the noise. We have um, lavender essential oil and citrus essential oil. The lavender is safe for all pets because a lot of times in our little room, there are two big dogs, one small cat, two kids, and two adults. Um, it brings calm and peaceful energy to the crowd, uh, to a crowded room full of high nerves, and also a citrus essential oil, just in case we need it. It brightens moods and lifts spirits, and I'm totally on the cat's spot right now. Um, so that's really great to have as well. And then we have books. Make some noise. We have books. They each have a favorite book to read. Again, a favorite book, but not a book that um, they love to read all the time. So um, we have Luke, the horse that wanted to be a unicorn for my six-year-old, and then Frosting and Friendship for my nearly nine-year-old. We have crayons and two coloring books, little fairy coloring books, so that they have something to appease them um, that, uh, you know, batteries aren't required for. We also have backup batteries for the pen light, pen lights. We have candles, and these are beeswax candles, little tea lights in case the power goes out and we want to conserve battery life. On our flashlights and then um, my girls are really into crystals and stones because I am too so we have hematite which is great for grounding and so sometimes they'll hold it sometimes they'll place it by the star um, earth star chakra so which is near the feet um, we have red jasper which is grounding stone we have amethyst which increases um, your connectivity to spirit. It's just a really calming stone. My girls both have big amethyst um, geodes in their rooms for um, bad dreams, and so they really appreciate the energy that amethyst brings. And then, I don't know if you can see this or not, but we found this, um, and it's just, it's got some iron in it. I think that's what causes the rust color. But if you look really closely, it looks like it has a guardian angel in it. And so we call it our guardian angel rock, and it lives in our Keep Calm kit. So all of this fits in our handy, I think this box is about 9 by 12. I'm um, on a frugal path now, so I uh, got it at the dollar store. It's about 9 inches by 12 inches, maybe 9 by 18, not positive. And it lives under the counter in our laundry room, which is our room that has all the, um, well, it's got all the, whoop, wrong side. See if I can figure that out. There we go. It's got all the gadgets on the wall, but it's also got um, four interior walls for storm protection. And you can see the messy laundry room. It lives in the cabinet right underneath the countertop. So I hope that helps. I hope you'll make a storm kit or a keep calm kit for you. You can also use this kind of thing for the car, although I would use uh, colored pencils instead of crayons in the car um, and for all sorts of things. So tell me below what you have in your keep calm kit more soon. I'm Audrey Christie from AudreyChristie.com. Toodles.